and welcome to The Tasting Couch. My name is Will. The Tasting Couch is a comfortable place where you can relax and enjoy fine spirits from around the world. Today we're tasting Jägermeister. The couch? It's a love sack sectional in Venetian taupe. Let's go to Germany. Jägermeister herbal liqueur. I remember in the late 90s going to bars and Jägerettes, uh, what the company called promotional girls, would appear out of nowhere, giving away ice-cold shots of Jäger. Marketing works. Since then, I always keep a bottle in my freezer. Let's take a look at the bottle and the liquid. The bottle is a green glass bottle. It is broad-shouldered with a short neck. The logo is embossed in both sides. The rectangular design proved to be stronger than a traditional round bottle. It has a paper label with gothic type lettering. Their logo is a stag with a illuminated cross between its antlers. There's a timeless German poem in the green frame around the label. And the top is a twist off metal cap. What does the juice look like? It's a very dark, rich, brown color. It's beautiful. Let's take a look at the legs. It's syrupy and it coats the glass. The legs are very thick and move slow. On the nose, the aroma. What do we smell? First and foremost, black licorice and anise seed. It's very aromatic. There are notes of cinnamon and pepper and clove. Let's taste. Prost. This has a very unique character. There are prominent notes of licorice and anise. It is very herbaceous. I taste cinnamon star anise, and nutmeg. Also present is orange peel and vanilla. There's a little heat from the alcohol. This is 70 proof. The mouthfeel is a little syrupy, most likely due to the sugar content. The finish is long. It coats your mouth and the licorice flavor stays with you. The history in the process. This brand was started in 1878 when Wilhelm Mass started a wine and vinegar business. His son, Kurt Mass, joined the family business and in 1934 created the recipe for an herbal liqueur he called Jägermeister. Kurt was a hunter and designed this brand to appeal to his fellow hunters. There's a tradition to start each hunt with a toast of Jägermeister and toast again at the end. The name Jägermeister means hunt master. The stag logo has to do with the Hubertus legend about a stag that appeared to a wild hunter and converted him to Christianity. He became the saint of all hunters, Saint Hubertus. The brand grew fast in Germany and around Europe. In 1972, Sidney Frank began importing Jägermeister into the United States. He's responsible for it becoming the number one selling herbal liqueur in the world. In the early 1980s, a Louisiana newspaper article stated that Jäger to the drinker is an instant value. After this was printed, sales skyrocketed. In the 1990s, Jägerettes were heavily promoting the brand in bars. In 1993, Sidney Frank introduced the first chilled shot tap machine. In 2003, there were over 100,000 Jäger chilled tap machines on back bars across the U.S. Sidney Frank died in 2006, and in 2015, Mast Jägermeister acquired Sidney Frank Importing. In 2019, 
U.S. sales were over 2 million 9-liter cases and over 7 million cases worldwide. Today, Jägermeister is Germany's number one selling liqueur. The process has not changed since the creation. Made from 56 natural ingredients, there are herbs, fruits, blossoms, and roots. Some are more prominent, like cardamom, star anise, ginger, cinnamon, and orange peel. All the spices meet strict requirements of the common agricultural policy. We don't know all 56 ingredients, as this is a closely guarded secret recipe. We do know that it's a long process and that it takes over a year to make. The secret blend of botanicals are weighed and then ground using mills to optimize the release of essential oils. The maturation process begins with dividing all the ingredients into four groups, spice, bitter, sweet, and citrus. Then they are soaked in open vats with distilled spirits for two weeks to pull out the flavor of the ingredients. They are all combined by the master distiller and left to rest for another three weeks to create the base of Jägermeister. At this point, it's over 100 proof. It is then filtered for the first time and put into one of 445 very large oak barrels where it is aged for one year. Then it's filtered for a second time through an ultra-fine filtration system. It is then mixed with alcohol, caramel, sugar, and water and bottled at 70 proof. There are 383 quality assurance checks along the entire process. How do I drink it? If you go to their website, you will see a running counter of how many ice cold shots are taken around the world. This is how I like to drink it and can say I may be a big contributor to that number. As for cocktails, there are many from the simple Jägermeister and soda to the very, very popular Jäger bomb. I'll put the recipe below. If you got any value out of this video, please hit the like button and subscribe. And follow us on Instagram at The Tasting Couch. If you made it to here, thank you for that. But that's the show. Please go out and buy a bottle at your local liquor store or order one online. I'll put the link below. Store it in your freezer as it's best ice cold. Prost!